I'd like to show you how to start and how to stop. You'll notice that my pattern is um, backwards. It's because we work on the back side and the other side is the, the finished side of the rug. To start, you want to just start with a little short end sticking out of your punch, just about a quarter inch. If you start with any more than that, you're wasting a lot of yarn. Starting is really easy. All you do is punch your needle in. That's all there is to it. To stop, when you're ready to end, all you're going to do is lift your needle up, and then you're going to pinch the yarn right there, slide the needle up out of the way, and you're going to just cut it off nice and close to the backing like that. Don't cut it off up here. Cut it right there. And you can see that there's a little teeny end sticking up. Just going to push it through to the other side. You'll see there's also an end sticking up where I started, and you're going to push that down as well with the tip of your scissors. You're not going to push it through here, here, or here. You're going to push it right through the same hole it's coming out of. As if it was a little worm sticking its head up out of its hole, you're going to push it right back down into the hole. like that. And you can push with your scissors or a knitting needle um, and all something like that. And here we have my starting and my stopping end. And you're going to trim those off so they're the same height as your loops. But I like to wait to do that until they're all surrounded. It makes it easier for me to cut them the right height. So there's a great trick so that you don't have to push that starting end through. I'd love to show it to you. I'm just going to pull this out. When I do pull out, I like to just push the ends together like that, the holes together. And the trick is called the thumb trick. And you're going to start with a nice little short end. Put your thumb on top and push down hard. Let's make it even shorter. Push down hard like that, and then you're just going to push down, release your thumb, and then you're ready to punch. And this little trick makes it so that the starting end is all ready on this side. So it saves a lot of time. It means you never have to push those little ends through.